I want those of you, I want everyone out there to, an, to answer me a question. How many of you guys were around, say, you know, were actually born, say, around the late 80s, early 90s? Depending on your answer, if it's yes or no. Now, what I want you to do is I want you to put yourself back into that time period of, say, about 92, 93. You know, maybe when you were a child or, or possibly, a, possibly a teenager at the time. And I want you, to, and I want you guys to think back. Wasn't there a game that came out in, say, 93, and it was really kind of, um, bad? Yep, there sure was. Of course, there's a lot of games that came out at, came out around that, came out at at that time period that really kind of sucked. And I just happened to have the trailer for one of them. For the definitive edition of a game that came out in 1993, and and it's all thanks to a certain to a certain somebody that this game was even no, was even known to a lot of people because I'm sure that they you know found the vid- found out about this game through his video. What am I talking about? You may you you may be so bold as to ask. Simple. The video I'm talking about is a video done by the angry video game nerd of Cinemassacre, by the way. And you might be wondering, well, what video is it? It's episode. It's from episode number 74, I believe. Yeah. Episode 74, I think. If any of you can remember what, what episode that was... Then you guys are going to kind of know where I'm going with this. So you might be wondering, oh God, what, what, what the, yeah, not going to worry about that. Anyway, sorry about that guys. Sorry about that. Um, yeah, so anyway, the game in question isn't really a game. Yeah, it's not really a game, but it came out on the Panasonic 3DO, I think. At least I think that's what it came out on. In 1993, I believe. I think. Could be wrong, though. I could be wrong. Oh. Why not? The game sucks anyway. So what game am I talking about? Well... I guess there's no sense in stalling any longer about it. Yep. Mm Mm-hmm. We got the Plumbers Don't Wear Ties Definitive Edition LRG3 release release date trailer. And no, I haven't seen this yet. But I thought, maybe, just maybe, we can have a little fun watching this. We can have a little fun watching this train wreck. We can finally watch this train wreck just go off the rails and finally go into, into, that, into that good night forever. Because this game fucking sucks. This game fucking sucks. It's not a game. It's just a bunch of slides. It's it's basically a slide. It's basically a slideshow thing that they made into a game. I don't know how. But yeah, I thought maybe I could have a little fun and watch it with you guys. So yeah. If you guys are ready. And I pray you are. Three, two, one, let's rock and roll.
Oh my god, it looks it looks just as bad now as it did back then. This game still sucks. Plumbers don't wear ties definitive edition. A re a remastered romantic comedy. First of all, this game isn't funny. It's not it's basically garbage. It's garbage, okay? It's garbage, people. Never play this piece of shit. Never buy it. Unless this game becomes, like, free to play or something like that, then I would recommend it. Because that's the only price that would be even, wor that would be even worth it. 15 yeah, believe it or not, this game costs 15 bucks on the Nintendo Switch, on the on the eShop and 15 bucks on PlayStation 4 and 5 I think <sighs> I swear this game is insane What the heck What you get like behind the scenes stuff Huh Oh god yep and there's the man who basically brought this game to notoriety right there. This man right here. James Rolfe, the angry video game nerd, as you might remember. Oh, God. Wait, why is he even mentioned in this? Wait, plumb the depths? The depths of what? Insanity? Okay, that makes sense to me. Really? What does this have to do with plumbers don't wear ties? Seriously, what does what does this what does this crap have to do with plumbers don't wear ties? It's a game that came out on the on the Panasonic 3DO in 1993. And it's about John and Jane basically ending up together. So, wait, it's about... It's about someone literally proving that they have no idea what they're doing. Unlock video featurettes? Like, what? Like, what? How... Like what? How much the, how much the people who made this game didn't know what they were doing? American produced visual. Who's this guy? Who's this clown? Really? So this guy actually worked on this piece of shit? No, really. This guy actually worked on this piece of shit. This game is terrible. This is the game, even. It's not. It okay. Wait, if I remember right, and I could be remembering this wrong, on the back of the 3DO box, didn't it say something like "plays like a game, feels like a movie" or something like that? And wait, didn't the nerd say in his video that th that that's horse shit? Yeah, that's horse shit. Because that's exactly what this game is. Shit. Yeah, that's right. I don't care. Someone needs to say it. Someone's got to have the guts to say it. And I will. I don't care. This game, this game needs to be torn a new one. And as far as I'm concerned, it is getting torn. Yeah, that's right. I said that. I don't care. As far as I'm concerned, this game sucks. It makes no sense. Why does this exist? It's me. Wait. Is that the actress from the from the actual from the game? Both the definitive edition and the original? The greatest remaster ever. 
that's a big load of horse shit and you know it. This is not remastered. It's not redone. All you did was basically add a bunch of crap, add a bunch of not, add, add a bunch of features to it that prove absolutely nothing. You have proved nothing. You have proved you don't know what you're doing. And wait, wait, is it just me, guys? Or is, or is Jane in this, um, this shot, this, this shot here? Does she actually look like she's laugh? Does she look like she's laughing? And why is Thresher or Thrasher or whatever his name is? Is this guy like smiling? Wait, why would he be smiling if he's holding her onto the railroad onto the railroad tracks? And yet this guy's supposed this guy right here is supposed to be the villain of the game. Okay. The greatest remaster ever of the worst game of all time. Gee, I wasn't I wasn't aware this game was I wasn't aware this game was Jekyll and Hyde. I wasn't aware this game was Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde, which by the way I still contend is the worst game of all time. People Please don't remake that game ever. That game sucks. Don't ever remake Jekyll and Hyde, please. Nobody remake that piece of shit. That game sucks. Everybody knows it. And this game can rot. Where can it rot? It can rot in hell for all I care. Let's go do it, quick. Jade, or whatever your, whatever your real name is, what were you thinking doing this? Seriously? Really? Really? Look at, look at these two images, people. Look at this. Original or nicer? They look exactly the same. Look. Here's the original. Here's the or nicer. They're exactly the same. You didn't... <sighs> Limited run games... You didn't do a damn thing to upgrade this, upgrade this game, did you? You didn't do a damn thing, did you? No. You know what you did? You sat on your ass, just added a bunch of special features, like a DVD, which this game should have been. This game should have just been a should have just been a DVD. And then that way, boom. Problem solved right there. Cause nobody would have bought this. Nobody would have nobody would have bought a movie called Plumbers don't wear ties. Oh, but people are probably curious if the game really is this bad. Well, as people are now finding out, yes, it really is this bad. It only became this Really? The original and the or nicer look exactly the same. There's no difference. Look. You guys can see it. Look. Original or nicer. Yeah. Again, original or nicer. It's exactly the it's exactly the goddamn same. Really? Lady Lady, I'm going to clue you in on something you're not aware of. This game really, really sucks. This game is so, is so insane that it would drive a person, it would drive a person literally crazy 
to see it ever be made. I don't know what the people on the 3DO were thinking when they when they allowed this pilot, when they allowed this shit heap to appear on their system. I really don't know. What? What were you thinking? Limited run games, what were you thinking, my friends? Allowing this game to ever resurface ever again. You should have kept this game buried in a vault. This game should have stayed buried in a vault. Trust me. It would have saved the world and people like me our sanity. Really? So wait, interviews? So wait, 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 hang on. So do they actually do interview do they actually do an interview with James with James Rolfe about the about the episode? If they do, that would be something to actually watch. That'd be the only reason to even get this is to watch the interviews rather than just pl- rather than play this rather than play this shit heap. That's right. This game fucking sucks. This game is awful. It's terrible. It's horribly written. The dialogue makes no sense. The characters are uninteresting. The plot the plot's half baked. The story is just ugh, is nauseating. And nothing about this game makes any makes any damn sense. Really? Audio commentaries and deleted scenes? So you so Limited Games, let me get this straight. You actually put all this junk into the into this yet there's some other games you've come out with that basically you just did nothing with? And you couldn't have actually given this to someone who actually maybe could have made it half decent. This game is basically the substandard what what you would call a game. Yes. This is substandard garbage. So wait. Here's a question that nobody that nobody's asking. Did they do a interview with the with the actors after this game was done? I mean, did they do like an interview saying like yeah, how did it feel to how did it feel to basically be in a game that th- that about that sometime around thirty years later, people are going to actually play on their on on some or people are actually that people do you think people are actually going to want to play this game? Little did people little did they know that yes, people actually have played this game. And now they understand why this game has has the reputation it does. It's awful. Either people love it, I'm giving it too much credit, or they hate, hate it. Is it oh, pl- people, never buy this game, okay? Don't buy this game, okay? Save your sanity and save your money. Show co- show games. I mean, show companies like limited run games that were not going to tolerate crap like this ever again. And if you already bought it, I'm sorry you did. You got ripped off. This is not a game. It's not. It's a barely coherent pile of garbage that frankly needs to be flushed down the toilet. No, it's barely coherent. The story barely makes any sense. The characters are barely even interesting. Guys, if you're gonna if you're gonna play this game, here's what I recommend you do. I recommend you play something like Mario Kart 8 on the case of the Switch, and maybe something like I don't know, something like like Dragon Ball Z Kakarot on the PS4 or PS5. 
at least in that way, you're playing something that's actually, you know, interesting and might actually keep your attention. This pile of junk does not. What do you think it's funny? Jane, you know as well as I do that's a complete lie. Lady, you know as well as I do that's a complete lie. This game is not interesting. It's not good. It's not well done. It sucks. It's horrible. It makes no logical sense. It's a piece of shit. It needs to be stopped. And it needs to be destroyed. This game sort of has a legacy. See, that's very special. Why? <sighs> Seriously. If they actually did interview James about the episode that he did on Plumbers Don't Wear Ties, you gotta wonder what were they thinking? What were they thinking even releasing that game in the first place? I think you'll love it. You got me. Oh, get this. Get, get this, you guys. It came, out in, on, it came out in September of 2023 on the Nintendo Switch, PS5, PS4, Xbox, and Steam. Would I recommend anyone picking this game up? Hell no. Would I recommend people spend their money on, like, on games that don't suck? Absolutely. Do I recommend people actually play something that's good? You da you're damn right I do. Yeah. So would I recommend you guys ever play this game? No. Would I recommend you guys never play this game? Absolutely. So as far as I'm concerned, the idiots who made this game, fuck you. You fucked up. You know you fucked up. This game sucks. I don't know what you were thinking. Ugh, and thank, and thank the Lord this is over. So if you guys did enjoy this video, and I hope and I pray you did. Leave a like on the video for my suffering that I just went through. And for God's sakes, guys, don't buy this game. It sucks. It sucks. Fifteen bucks is not worth is not worth your sanity. You could spend that 15 bucks doing, like, something else with it. Oh, yeah. You could. So, guys, please leave a like on the video because I suffered enough for the, for, for, by watching this. Leave your thoughts and, and a game trailer reaction you want me to do, and I'll get to it in the future. And, guys, share this video around for, for those in need, for for those who want to see this god-awful video. And if you guys want to download this video and, and upload and re-upload it to your channel, go ahead. I do not care. As a matter of fact, I encourage it. Spread this video around as much as you can. So that way people know about this god-awful game. So that way people know not to buy it and know never to play it. And guys, do not forget to subscribe. Do not forget to subscribe for more of me and these videos you will see.